CBS News Bay Area. This is the Evening Edition. Now at 11, one local business owner is not feeling the holiday spirit after a thief takes off with his food truck on Christmas Eve. How it's hurting his business and his community. We usually give food out to the homeless in the food truck. Somebody come take everything from you in six minutes. But this is the season of giving, and so many in the Bay Area are finding ways to give back and serve thousands of warm meals. Plus, we tag along with some Bay Area shoppers scrambling to get those last-minute gifts before Christmas Day. Good evening, mm. I'm Adriana Cotta. Hope you had a very merry Christmas Eve. We now have just less than an hour until Christmas Day. San Francisco and San Jose City Halls both lit up in red and green tonight to mark the occasion. And a lot of people out enjoying the holiday day in Union Square, taking pictures in front of the Christmas tree, hitting the ice rink, and just spending time with loved ones. And one of the hottest tickets in town every holiday season is the San Francisco Gay Men's Course Holiday Show. They concluded the series at the Castro Theater tonight. Take a listen. <laughs> The Gay Men's Chorus performed three shows tonight at the Castro Theater, wrapping up the annual holiday tradition. The tour also included shows in Berkeley, Sonoma County, and San Francisco Sydney Goldstein Theater. Sadly, it's not all about celebrations tonight. A man in the East Bay needs help to find his food truck after it was stolen early this morning. And if losing a vital part of your business on Christmas Eve wasn't bad enough, it's also preventing him from helping others in need. Kelsey Thorin has that story. The owner of Touch of Soul here in Emeryville is asking for the public's help. He woke up this Christmas Eve to find his food truck was stolen just hours before he was supposed to host an event in it, giving out Christmas meals to the homeless. Oh, 